Gango, I got this can can tutorial. You know, double R2 is coming out hella soon. So I made this can can type of beat. It's one of the more chill ones, kind of similar to some shit off way too geeked. Maybe like the vibe of live fast, die slay, fall on, that type of shit. Gonna be breaking down this beat. Let's go! First thing started off with was this chord progression, and I used this soft piano from Labs. Kind of an X8 type of chord progression, but I think it fits the style for Can. So here's what it sounds like. It's hella smooth. And for effects, just got this ambience on 18%. Next, pull up Xenology and pulled up this orc flute and laid out this mel. Here's what it sounds like. And for the effects on this, an ambience at 30%. This EQ kind of just cutting out the lows and the highs. Then I got a shaper box preset, this crush filter downwards, and this chord maker kind of just giving it wider sound, I guess. That's what this chord maker does, and yeah. Then the next sound I pulled up was this hollow pad. And then also for this, did cut out the low. Next, pull up this pure pipe soft lead out of JV1080 and laid out this little lead. Next, pull up this sign bell and laid out this melody. Alright, next on I got out of Xenology, this is Dreaming Bell Pad, it's a synth bell pad, and just laid out this simple ass melody, here's what it sounds like. And for the effects on this, ambience, first preset, default one at 31%. Then we got love filter on the default at 38%. Then I got a gate from love filter, the basic one gate turned up all the way. An effectrix preset with this phaser and these presets right here. And this EQ, cutting out lows. Then last sound for the melody is these chords, same chords as the beginning, but we just have these top line little notes and melodies that I just added for this part. And the preset we got out of analogy JP8 strings four. Here's what it sounds like. Also for effects on this, just ambience at 56%. So those are all the melodies. With these type of beats, you want to go for hella ambient and like luscious, kind of like angelic type of sounds. So that's why I went with the piano, the flute, and all the sounds that I did choose. So now for the drums, I start off with this pluggy clap. And on the clap, I do have some ambience, 2%, and a phaser turned up to 27%. Then next, pull up these hi-hats and laid out this pattern right here. Nothing too crazy, kind of just like a two-step, but taking out some notes to give it some more bounce and also adding some notes and some lower octaves and a roll at the end. Then next, pulled up this little perk out of this polo kit. It's like a filtered rim. Here's what it sounds like. As well as the snare right here. And last sounds, we got the 808s. So first, we got this first 808. Then we got this second 808 pattern. And 
then we just got this third 808, but just same pattern as the first, the very first 808, just a different 808. And one more thing, added this Mel in the verse, just for some variation. It's out as analogy, this soft pad, here's what that sounds like. Just hella repetitive. When you're trying to add like smaller stuff to beats, you want to make it repetitive and not too complex. And then for the effects, just an EQ boosting the high mid section, lowering the treble, lowering some mid, and then as well as this ambience default preset on 29%. So yeah, that's the whole beat for arrangement. Nothing too crazy. Just started off with this five bar intro right here then went into the chorus with the pad all these sounds right here then added the flute the second part of the chorus with the 808 switch then verse drop hella sounds and then repeat that whole thing over there so let me know if you fuck with this tutorial let me know if you like the beat and uh yeah that's me love you gang follow me on ig arkham discord you know links in the description say it every video every outro and question for this video Who's your favorite artist right now, you know? Who do you be listening to the most? Let me know down below in the comments. Real ones, if you made it all the way here, you know, I'm a no down below in the comments. And, uh, yeah, that's me. Love you, gang. Bye.